you guys got to understand, like I, I'm, I'm, it's, I'm fighting that battle at the same with you guys, but I'm looked upon as the, that guy that is, is the one against the girl. It's always a guy against a girl, but it's not that way you guys. And, no. and, and we were talking about, it's like, we need to discuss this because um, we got to know what kind of people and predators people are like, just because you're a man in this community, right? Like me, like, I, you know, I wear my heart on my sleeve and we tell the truth and, you know. I just find it really funny that Doug claims that he's the victim and everybody's out to get him. And there's this huge crime ring. And here he is committing a cyber sex crime, crying victim, but he's the abuser. It's just, it's mental gymnastics. It's, it's mind blowing. We funded all by Katie also. It's probably Katie's uh, dildos. And I'll show you that uh, she should have said that she thought I was gay. But what really freaked me out, too, is I never asked for anything, and I never said anything about any sexual stuff or dating or... So I will not let you guys see all of the email all the time or her phone numbers. But you guys will see I, I, I did color over her boobies uh, again. Because we got to show you that these people are sending me stuff to turn around and play like I asked for it. But you can't send it for a very first text introducing yourself. Then it doesn't, it has no paper trail saying I asked for anything. I'm going to take it for the team because I obviously, uh, I asked her probably for titty pics right first. You guys, a scam started with doohickey. And, uh, I mean, I'm sorry. Check my live stream. That's what's great. You can't get it shut down. I'm not doing anything illegal. I'm exposing you guys. So see here. This is 10-4-2021. Look, received attachment. Get ready. Close your eyes if you want, but it's covered oh, a little bit. Okay. I didn't ask for shit. This is her second email to me. A few times here and there. But you don't you don't get like a lot of fangirl email or anything. I don't know if I ever take it that way. I mean, everybody is so. I mean, everybody is like a potential girlfriend or, or future ex wife. <laughs> that that because they're so everyone's so nice. Everyone they send no, pictures. But I they mean, send, like, so you know, it's me, and, and and they're so nice, and they're never dirty pictures and bad or anything like that. But there's just so many nice people that there's so many. Oh, so nobody. A lot of good fish out there. So nobody in the so nobody from YouTube has ever sent you like has ever sent you unsolicited dirty pictures. No. You got that? Yeah, I have. Have I modded them yet? <laughs> no, I don't think so. Okay. Let me know which who I, who I need to mod. I mean, I don't. Look, I mean, I would I would start like an, an email for just side boob. Like I think it's important just like. Get me, get me out of the funk I'm in with the. Cause Candace really screwed up the whole side boob thing for me. So I think if I had good potential, good side boobs, maybe some teardrop side boobs, maybe some natural side boobs, like I could get back into it like really quick. That could probably help a lot. I mean, I love boobs so much I grew my own. Gosh, <laughs> see, look, talk about like, nothing. Like, I have no problems with anybody. They're all great. You can subscribe or unsubscribe from my channel. I don't care. Katie says she must have sent the nudes, not the only one. Sunday nude pictures for Joshua at the lab. Lab, lab. <laughs> Welcome to the lab Sundays for shinners. Make a picture Sunday shinners. The rest of this video is edited uh, as Doug wanted to hide the fact that he asked women to send him naked pictures. They weren't unsolicited. There's no wonder that he had subs sending him pictures. Now he's distributing these pictures without consent and using them as blackmail, as bullying. This is considered cyber sexual harassment. I'm not sure how we have some women defending and encouraging his behavior. Nobody should be applauding this. It's not okay. It's not right. And to anyone that is a victim or survivor, do not trust Doug. Stay far away from him as he'll only exploit you 
abuse you or use you in some kind of way.